Question number nine, Phil Twyford. Thank you, Mr Speaker. My question is for the Minister for Social Housing. How many state house tenants turned down properties because of birds chirping in nearby trees, because a backyard was too small for a trampoline, or because they disliked the colour of a door? Mr Speaker, oh, this question is so last year. Um, I, but that's fine. Let's have another go. Let's have another go. Um, what the member is referring to is what we call uh, people who decline an offer of a social house without sufficient reason. Um, from when the changes took effect that I put in on the 25th of January to the end of September, um, there were 1,760 offers of houses made um, that were declined, and 144 offers were found to be turned down for insufficient reasons. Supplementary. Supplementary question, Phil Twyford. Why did she take three examples to portray 69,000 state house tenants as the ungrateful and undeserving poor in order to play politics with the most vulnerable people and make herself look tough? Well, Mr. The Speaker. Honourable Paula Bennett. A bit of kettle black there, mate. It's you that's doing that. No, supplementary. Not Supp not. supplementary question, Phil Twyford. Why did she say... Point of order, the yes. Right Honourable Winston Peters. No, Speaker, no way that that minister could call you a kettle or black. Uh, she's been around long enough, probably not experienced enough to take a higher job, but she should know standing orders and Speaker's rulings. Order. And I would also hope that the member would know standing orders and Speaker's rulings. It was changed, I think, in 2011, so the only person who can take a point of order on that matter is indeed the Speaker himself. If it is done absolutely deliberately and consistently, then the debate or question time would be interrupted. But then the event is done on occasions and not deliberately directed to the Speaker, we allow it to leave. I will find the particular standing orders and refer it to the member for his education. <coughs> Supplementary question, Bill Twyford. Why did she say that contamination figures are shockingly high and label innocent tenants as worse than animals when she knew that housing in New Zealand's methamphetamine testing has been shown to be a completely incompetent waste of money that cannot prove meth manufacture or hazardous levels of residue? The Mr. Honourable Speaker. Paula Bennett. Well, Mr Speaker, I have never, ever referred to tenants in that manner, and that member, yet again, is overreaching, exaggerating, and in this case, uh, just plainly not telling the truth. Order. 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 The last part is out of order. A member Sorry. cannot accuse another of uh, not telling the truth. He can certainly... Any member can take it up in another matter, and I refer members to Standing Order 359. Supplementary question, Phil Twyford. Point of order, Mr Speaker. Point of order, Phil Twyford. I Twyford. seek leave to table the stuff story that contains the words, order. these order. people are no. worse order. than animals. Order. Stuff stories are freely available to all members if they decide to report it. Further supplementary? Supplementary question, Phil Twyford. Does she believe that someone who would deliberately call state house tenants worse than animals that would say that homeless people don't want to be helped in the case of the Pullman Park flying squads and call state house tenants ungrateful and undeserving has the character and integrity to be a deputy leader? Mr Speaker. The Honourable Paula I, Mr Speaker, I just simply don't abide by the um, members' characteristics. Supplementary question, Phil Twyford. Why is the government sending officials to Australia on Monday to try and sell Christchurch's state houses to Australian companies when for the last few years she has been trying to spin the state house sell-off as being about boosting local New Zealand community housing providers. Mr Speaker. The Honourable Paula Bennett. Uh, Mr Speaker, um, I stand by our policy around uh, getting more community housing providers involved in social housing. I think it's good for tenants, I think it's good for New Zealand. Point of order. Point of order. Point of order for Twyford. I seek leave of the House to table an invitation from the government uh, to Australian companies to a briefing at KPMG's 
headquarters on Monday. Order, and I just, order, I just in need Sydney, the source, source of the document. How's the member's uh, It's been obtained via KPMG. I'll put the leave. Leave the House can so leave a sort to table a particular invitation to a KPMG uh, function to be held in Australia. Order. Leave a sort to table it. Order. Leave a sort to table this particular document. Is there any objection? There is none. It can be tabled. <coughs> Question number 10.